Hello guys, welcome back. So, I made some purchases on TikTok. I don't really use TikTok all that much, but I recently started using it and I made some purchases. I bought some shit. I bought, I didn't buy this on TikTok. As you can see, my skin looks like shit right now. Can't help it. Dry face, a breakout, I don't know. Bad skin, I don't have skincare. I don't do skincare. So I found this Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence. I don't even know what the fuck it's for. Being 96% snail secretion filtrate, this essence helps the skin to lose less moist while keeping the skin smooth and healthy. Apply evenly to face directions. This is Korean skincare, so I know that this is like step two or three out of like seven. Is what you're supposed to do. Um, but fuck okay, it, I'm just gonna put some on right now. This is obviously not how you should be doing it. You're probably supposed to like rinse and then like cleanse, and then you're supposed to tone, and then uh whatever the fuck after. So that's the first thing that I bought. Uh obviously can't give it a review. It doesn't really smell like anything, it smells like nothing. Um, and it is thicker than water but um is this snail cum i don't know something else i bought not very happy about it i'm gonna be very honest with you i'm just looking for the receipt okay okay so have you guys seen aqua sound there's like this thing called aqua sound and they're like supposed to be earbuds that you can use in the shower and so tried them out put them on they are so fucking so they're this is what they look like okay they're really tight they don't move like they don't really bend and the speaker you would assume, because just like if you're looking out of like, have you grabbed like headphones typically out of like little boxes like this, you'd assume obviously like left and right. And then you'd assume to like put this part in here. But it turns out that the speaker is like on the outside part. The speaker's on the little bubble. There's a big bubble that has the button and the light. And then there's the other bubble that has the actual speaker. And so... You're supposed to like put it. Uh, I'm telling you right now, if you're a man, you got big ears. Don't fucking buy this shit because this is for like little girls. This is for kids. OK, do not buy these one size earbuds off of TikTok that cost forty dollars. Because. Unless you're buying it for your fucking daughter, your little sister. Ah, oh, this shit fucking hurts, bro. Fuck. Okay, one more time. I'm gonna try it. One more time. Okay, look at how red my fucking ear is. The problem with this, in my opinion, is that it's not... Well, again, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm a man and I got big ears. But it's like... It sits, but there's like a cushion of air that it's not, that is there. There's no noise cancellation, number one, which, I mean, if you're in the shower, don't you want like that plug? You want that seal, don't you? So there's no seal here, and the speaker, it sounds like you're listening, like the way that the sound quality, what I would describe the sound quality as, is listening to a really like imagine you're in your bedroom you have your own bedroom and you share a wall with your like sibling your sibling is playing music on a really nice sound system and the other side of the wall is what this sounds like so worth forty dollars no maybe worth five dollars the fact that it's waterproof maybe ten dollars so you can put it in the shower. But it's like, honestly, just take your fucking phone and put it inside of a Ziploc bag. 
and bam, like you got you got fucking you got your phone inside of the fucking shower right there. That's what I think you should do. That's what I think is the easiest one. I bought some other shit, but they've been taking so long to get here. Does anyone else has anyone else tried shit off the TikTok shop? Because it's taking forever. It is taking forever. I bought this Aqua Sound twelve days ago. I guess that's not the worst. But I also bought the Thunder Jet. And that one was eighty dollars. And that shit isn't even near here. I bought I bought one of those funny greetings, those like that African dance group where they're like Happy birthday. Mizut. Mwah. Mwah. And then they like do their dance. It was it was worth it. I highly recommend that one. Funny greetings, highly recommend. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Lizzie. Lizzie. Best boss. Best boss. Another thing I bought, I spent $60 on candy, you guys. I spent $60 on candy. I got, it's from a store called Dulcito Loco. So I got a spicy gushers. These are really good. These are my favorite. I don't know if it's because they, they made them well or if it's because I just really love gushers. I just fucking love Gushers. Oh, you can tell I've been eating them. I fucking love Gushers. I'm seeing on the side that it says medium spicy. And it is kind of like these. They just taste like Gushers. And then afterwards, you just feel this me heat. Oh, but they're fucking... I love Gushers. If you can find spicy Gushers... I recommend those. They are crazy good. I also got some like Skittles. These were not as good. These were more like uh, poppable, but they're just like, they're literally, I don't know. I'm not a fan of Skittles. The way that I have Gushers, which is weird because rainbow, but yeah, no, not a fan of Skittles. You know, get these for your daughter. Get these for your son if he's like under 14. Then I got watermelon slices. This is what they look like. Like just like a little, a basic ass little watermelon so those were the watermelon slices top tier top tier honest mixed sour belts this is also top tier you guys these are really good and then the fact that there's so many different flavors because it's like there's like red there's yellow there's blue there's green there's orange there's pink Maybe there's pink, I don't know. But these are so good. This is a, I don't know what color this is. Is this yellow or pink? I think that was supposed to be mango. So I'm gonna assume yellow. And then I got some strawberry tubes. These are not that good, you guys. These are actually, actually not that great. They have like an aftertaste. So they look like a, you know, like a cool little whatever thing, 
But um, look, I'll show you. Like you know, can you see the the white, the tube, the candy itself tastes like strawberries and cream. So then, imagine you're eating a yo play yogurt, like a strawberry yo play yogurt, and then there's like a hint of chile afterwards. These are not it. It's strawberries and cream and chile. <laughs> it's fucking... I once made a smoothie with fresh strawberries, tahin, and whey protein powder. Like unflavored whey protein powder. And it tasted like a spicy strawberry yogurt. I made a spicy frozen strawberry yogurt. This tastes like the candy version of that strawberry yogurt with tahin. It's it's not, it's not it. Don't get the strawberry tubes unless you want strawberries and cream. Watermelon rings. Watermelon rings. Simple, basic. They got that watermelon flavor. What do you want? They're so good. Oh my God, those are so good. These are so good. It's spicy and mango. Es lo que sigue. It's spicy and mango. So, they look like kidneys, lima beans, that are just like gently covered in some sort of chamoy? I don't know. So I'm inside a car in the heat, going to church, surrounded by perfume. This has a perfumey. This has a perfumey. Perfumey. A perfume aftertaste. It's not great. Not bad. Not great. time for me to shine. A spicy bear. Spicy bears unite. These are actually really good. They're just gummy bears that are covered in like a chile. And it's like, I didn't realize how much I loved gummy bears. I love gummy bears. It's just a gummy bear that's covered in some chile. So fucking good. I'll be honest, when it comes to this one, there is no like chile flavor. You straight up just taste the gummy bears and um, feel the heat. Similar to the gushers where you like taste the gushers and you feel the heat. <clears throat> Tamarindo paletas. This one I'm not going to try on camera right now because it's a fucking, it's like those mango veras, those mango vera yellow paletas covered in like, in like, I don't know, I'll show you. I was like, that's what I want. That's what I want. It's just a big fucking paleta covered in tamarindo. It's not so good, actually. There's like a, there's a certain flavor to this chile that gets a little sour. And I guess I'm just not the biggest fan of sour chile. I like sour chile, but not to the extent that this is. But like, you 
Oh my god, it's so much. If you're a kid, you're gonna like this. I think. Maybe. Probably. They're not bad, they're just strong. Peach rings. Let me tell you something. Let me explain to you. If I had to have like a favorite candy, it would be peach rings or those like um those old lady strawberry candies. You know the wrappers, you know the ones. That like, you know, it's like a little wrap, it's like a little red with like the little design on the bottom, and then the part that's twisted up is like green. So it's like a little strawberry. You can see them as strawberries, you can see them as pineapples, but that type of candy, that hard candy. So good to me. So good. I love it. I love it. I just do. And um, peach rings. Peach rings are also a part of that. Like, ever since I was a kid, something about, like, having, like, the peach rings doing that. Fucking gross, sticky hands. Kids are the worst. Kids are the worst. Peach looks very similar to the watermelon. Tastes like a spicy peach ring. Tastes like a spicy peach ring. That's actually pretty much everything that's arrived so far. I don't. I'm waiting on the Thunder Jet. I don't think I bought anything else. I think that's it. I think I'm just waiting on the Thunder Jet now. So we're just gonna see if, like, it, like, you know, if it goes. But okay, that's that.